So this tune is called The Kid on the Mountain. It's a slip jig and there are five parts. Um, very well known, probably the most famous of all the slip jigs, I'd say. It was popularized back in the 20s or 30s by uh, the famous Michael Coleman, great Sligo fiddler. Um, so here's a, 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 a simple, basic version of the tune. As I said, it's a slip jig, so it's a 9 8, and the rhythm is uh, a count of three. One, two, three, one, two, three. <laughs> So that would be the first phrase. And the next phrase. So again, it's the kind of call and answer idea. First one. Second one. And then that repeats. So I'll just play that whole section the A part. So the, the Kid on the Mountain is usually played at a fairly uh, fast tempo, something like... Um, one, two, three, one, two, three. But uh, I'm going to take the tempo down a little bit for the purpose of this uh, demonstration. Um, give you a chance to absorb some of the places I might add rolls, triplets, variations, etc. So the, the very opening note, uh, most of the time I would play that E um, as a roll, a long E. But often I play it as three separate notes. And at the beginning I'd probably choose to play it as three separate notes. Just to kind of set the, the rhythm uh, of the slip jig. And uh, I always find starting, playing, when your very first note is a roll, there always seems to be a risk of it not coming out clearly. So I'd probably save that till the next time round. So, and again, if you remember in the, if you saw the, the jig uh, demonstration uh, in the, in the uh, dance rhythm section, you might have remembered that I talk about slurring onto the beat, so this slip jig measure has three beats. Thank you. 